We just wanna be pretty, pretty that's the goal We just want this money, get a man be whole Why we even trying, don't deserve a raise Want my boss to hit it, live a life this way We just wanna be pretty, pretty that's the goal We just want this money, get a man be whole This is America, don't catch you climbing up don't catch you climbing up, cause they'll get you slipping up. Hey, come on! This is America. We'll say North America. Look how we living now. The boys could be tripping now. What the pumpkin spice latte, unseasoned chicken, raisins in a potato salad, fuck was that? Nicole Arbor, let me ask you a question. You done fucked up, you know that, don't you? This is how we gonna do it, y'all. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Paraphrase. Yeah, um, I'm at a fucking loss for words here. Um, that's probably the most horrible thing I've seen in a while. So, last week, um, Childish Gambino put out this new video for a song called This Is America. In this video, it was like, basically, it was about, some people thought it was about, you know, the gun control issue in America. Some people thought it was just about, like, you know, the typical black experience in America, but you know, it's all up to your interpretation, but the video was like straight fire, you know what I'm saying? This uh, woman named Nicole Arbor from somewhere in Canada decided she wanted to remake that and be an advocate, a advocate for uh, women's rights. I mean, I get what she was trying to do, but she did not execute that very well. Like, Nicole Arbor, what, what the hell was you thinking? Like, how did you think this was gonna turn out? I mean, come on, like, there's so many things wrong with this video. First of all, the track itself was mixed and mastered horribly. I couldn't take you seriously with all that whack-ass dancing you was doing. See, Charles Gambino, his dance steps was on point. Yours was not. Shit like this is why the Wakandans kept all that vibranium to themselves for centuries at a time. I understand you felt like you was inspired by Josh Gambino's video and all that. And I know it was some I know there was some people that tried to make it a race thing, but this is just I'm not even making it a race thing. I'm making it about talent versus no talent. And you're on the side of no talent here. I get what you were trying to do, but in light of that, I can't take you seriously as an advocate for any demographic marginalized people. And you want to know why? Because a few years ago, you did a vlog where you basically body shamed fat people. Needless to say, I took offense to that. And I ain't forgot about it. I'm like an elephant. I don't forget a damn thing. Oh, you don't know what I'm talking about? Oh, I kept the receipts up. Check it out. Fat shaming is not a thing. Fat people made that up. Yeah, but I couldn't fit into a store. That's discrimination. Uh, no. That means you're too fat and you should stop eating. Are you gonna tell the doctor that they're being mean and fat shaming you when they say you have f***ing heart disease? Obesity is a disease? Yeah, so is being a shopaholic. The prosecution rest. Look, for any YouTubers, any comedians out there that's gonna try to remake somebody's joint to get a point across on another issue, make sure you just be even lightweight clever with this shit. Like, I saw I saw this last night and I just been up all night thinking of ways I was gonna like so ass up. I don't but you know what? The shit just speaks for itself. You tried to make a point, you tried to advocate for women's rights, but you failed miserably by putting out such a whack ass video. Me ain't getting no sympathy out of me. Oh, and it looks like Charlemagne the God just gave your ass donkey of the day. And you earned that title. I don't even know why you even let this shit get out. Like, come on, you had to have seen this coming. Like, are you trying to commit career suicide? The shit was just whack, man. The track was whack, the video was whack, the choreography was whack. Nicole Arbor, let me just be the first to say... Congratulations, you played yourself. Anyways, I'm paraphrased. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel, drop a like, drop a dislike if you ain't feeling it. Tell the homies. 
If you ain't already heard my new mixtape, Sincerely Yours, the link is in the description. Go check that out, it's dope. Unlike this whack ass shit Nicole Harvey just put out. I take the seat, drop a deuce, hop on IG. Women crush Wednesdays or drop knowledge, probably. Debating with right wingers and white supremacists. They telling me to vacate the premises. Go back to Africa to be more precise. But I'm part of the problem, yeah, right. Tuck the phone away, cause I ain't expecting no calls. Then I stop to analyze the walls of the stars. They riddle with all kinds of fuckery. But I ain't caught up in that bullshit, luckily. I see a phone number to some bomb head. 901. Nah, I can't do that. Mostly they riddle with gang insignias. You'll never know who did it like Ferb or Phineas.